With much emphasis being placed on COVID-19, Regions 2, 7, 8, 9, and 10 now have hotlines. Minister of Public Health, the Honorable Valda Lawrence, in updating the nation today, stated that the COVID-19 hotlines will enable more Guyanese to access information and health advice and to report possible cases of the deadly virus. To date, Region 4 has recorded 17 out of the 19 confirmed COVID-19 cases in Guyana. Region 3 and 6 have only recorded one confirmed case each. Providing the nation on Thursday with an update of the current COVID-19 statistics, Minister of Public Health, the Honorable Valda Lawrence, said as of April 1, 2020, the situation in Guyana has changed dramatically. The number of confirmed cases remains at 19, with one inconclusive. However, our new deaths on April 1, 2020 were two, bringing the total number of deaths to four. Minister Lawrence said calls to the COVID-19 hotline have moved to 1,252, while a total of 75 persons have been tested. 19 positives, 55 negatives, and one inconclusive. It was also disclosed that COVID-19 hotlines are now accessible in regions 2, 7, 8, 9, and 10. The number of persons in institutional quarantine is now 31. 11 persons are in isolation, with one person hospitalized in the COVID-19 ICU unit. The number of persons currently on home quarantine known by the Ministry of Public Health is 121. The Public Health Minister is pleading for Guyanese to heed the calls from the authorities to avoid large gathering and to practice social distancing. My fellow Guyanese, I have been noticing that despite the countless messages appealing to you to be responsible to comply with the advisory measures that the Ministry of Public Health, along with other partners, has put in place in the interest of mitigating the spread of the virus. And to keep us all safe, you are still breaching the protocols and behaving as if you are immune to the disease. Let me remind you that COVID-19 has no boundaries. Persons are urged to wear protective gear over their mouth and nose if you must go out. Globally, there has been 823,626 confirmed cases, while the total amount of deaths stand at 40,598. In the regions of the Americas, there is some 188,751 confirmed cases and 3,400 deaths. For InfoHub, I am Kellon Rover reporting.